My good name is Dopas DJ DJ Viano. Hope unazidi kubarikiwa pale nyumbani tumeko kwenye war room section with Pastor Prince hapo hivyo. Unajua the end of the day imekuwa mada kidogo impressing change na tumekuwa kwa segment ambayo imekuwa pia maombi na najua umeza kushugulikwa vizuri sana. Thank you so much for each and every one bomb keep company from 7am until now. Thank you so much for each and every one bomb na come to the social media hapo hivyo make sure that una show the love. Na kama uko pale nyumbani make sure that you connect with us our SMS line iko pale chini so that uh, at the end of the day we can just uh, have that uh, conversation uh, as we have conversation up IV, we can also have a, that conversation on a social media platform etako vizuri sana tupata kwenye tupata pia kwenye west tv facebook kwa pale uh, west tv family tupata uh, west tv and then kwenye twitter tupata west tv underscore kenya kwenye instagram info dot west tv and then kwenye tweet uh, kwa utupio na zani follow pia dj viano dopes dj facebook kwenye twitter tupata dj viano kenya and then kwenye instagram dj viano so allow me to just dive into this conversation about embracing change vitu zimekuwa zikihappen hapa na pale but kuna wale pia uh, tuliwajua kitambo kidogo uh, wakishikilia mike na squeeze tunamwona pia ni anashikilia bible na all these things is about change 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 kuna yule pia uh, partner ambaye atakuwa to join maybe na short way atakuwa pia yeye na alikuwa danza na today namuona na makamera photography nini na happen it's just embracing change na everything we just embrace change in the good platform and the platform of Christ Jesus I'll see you so allow me to pull to welcome one of the amazing friend uh, uh tumekuwa pale hivyo gigs hapa na pale uh, tulijuana kitambo na pia sasa yeye ni mgeni hapa hivi na pia maybe unamwona for the first time so yeye atakuwa ina happen and make sure that you get connected with us on social media platform kama mwana mara ya kwanza achilia ujumbe na itakuwa vizuri sana karibu MC Budget Asante sana bro. <laughs> good that long time. Long time bro. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Amen. I remember uh, the last time that we hooked up together mm. is from the that gig it was in Webuye. Webuye Salazangu concert. Sal Salazangu concert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is the time that we hooked up together and we were, we were just in the uh tukitoka Webuye to Bungoma. Mm. We had a good conversation kwa gari and I'm glad mm. that uh, maze God I'm going to take you this level man. Mm. How has been the journey man? The journey has not been easy bro. Mm -hmm. uh, of course when I came I started music mm -hmm. I likuwa challenging mm -hmm. uh kulikuwa na ups and downs mm -hmm. of course in, uh, in music industry mm -hmm. but also because nilingia into game na unajua ile fa ile fame mm -hmm. and everyone knows you you know. Wow. <laughs> Sasa ikani beba you know I was overwhelmed <laughs> with it. Ukakuta kwamba with within a short period of time yani mm -hmm. pia character yangu ka change wow. and other things you know Sasa nikaingia into the world mm -hmm. world world na ikafika time mm -hmm. because I've been raised in a Christian family mm -hmm. uh, nimezaliwa in a Christian setting I've grown up in church mm -hmm. but sasa ukiangalia the reality of the things that I was doing mm hiyo -hmm. time actually it was very against what actually the bible mm -hmm. wants us to do mm -hmm. so imekuwa imekuwa good journey kwamba with, uh, within some time mm -hmm. uh, ikabidi ni take time mm -hmm. to just uh, uh, reflect about myself come back into a personal relationship na wow, God wow, until wow. now <laughs> it has been a journey uh, doing things uh, the other way around yeah. na bible inasema hivi but hold on kidogo mm. uh, acha nikiu this track by anaitwa anaitwa Messi Tamar mm. as uh, tuki asha in one of the amazing jamaa amekuwa dance uh, amekuwa dancer na amekuwa pale hivyo sasa anapiga shughuli fulani manzi atakuwa anatuambia anafanya nini but allow me to drop this track and then tutakuwa na tutakuwa na to join hapo hivyo Bossy Boy versus MC Badges and then DJ Viana and Dakwa Pai Alcia. Me tu ti angobo, me tu ke ti shapa. 
Welcome back my good name is Dr. DJ DJ Vian of course that is a song by Macy Tamar artist wa nguvu sana yuko maeneo yetu hapa hivi uh, kama umekuwa unafuatia the praise miss alikuwa hapa hivi na akashare jani yake ya kimziki pia that's a brand new track latest ambayo ametoa juzi na I'm glad that you can be able to vibe with it pale pale out na imekuwa vizuri sana au sio tukao tumeanza story na MC Bages but uh, acha tu mwalao tu maybe atuambie zile majina watu wanamjuaje maybe serikali na kutambua kivipi sina <laughs> mjaka <laughs> MC Bages <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> So official name yangu ni Moses mm -hmm. Bages Sikuku. Wow. Sikuku is my father's name. Wow. Stage name yangu sasa ndio ya artist name ni MC Bages. Kwani ukachukotiwa katikati? Ah, ya katikati ni unique bro. <laughs> <laughs> ni unique that name because um, mm -hmm. I, I thought pia unajua unajua kwa brand name inataka kitu unique. unique. So I, I, I thought ni nifikirie which name nikaona this second name mm -hmm. is very unique. Wacha nipick it. Alafu ile MC mm -hmm. I was just given. I was just given yo yo. Msali ku bless. Msali ni bless tu na MC. Kuna msana bless you mafon lakini wako bless you na jina ka bless you na jina. Before ni kuja kwa bossy boy hapa hivi atoa vipia serikali mtambua kivipi. Unajua mtu anatend ku believe that name. Mwanzo ulikuwa designer mnoma. Wewe kazi yako ulikuwa ma badges ama unajua zile za high school ulikuwa kizi print. Kuna hiyo perception lakini sasa umefahamu pia badges anatoka na nini jina lake tu hapo uh, hivyo na alichukua ni mmoja from one of the names hapo na ikaweza ku stand out au sio bossy boy yes. karibu sana bana shukran kabisa umetokeza wapi na jo umelalia event kwani mse mtu busy <laughs> <laughs> ya yeah, mm -hmm. kwa event umelalia though nimefika mm -hmm. uh, na shukuru god mzee uko poa kabisa niko fresh kabisa serikali na kutambua kivipi bro okay serikali na nitambua kama clevian jc Hi Jesus. Mzee uko far away from you. That name on the bossy boy. <laughs> okay, the journey to arrive to the name now you're being called bossy boy. Boss boy. Yeah, ilitokana il ilitokana na nini? Okay, boss boy actually mimi niliangalia eh like mimi ilikuwa mimi mwenyewe niliangalia like I control myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hakuna msana ana control ana control. Hakuna msana ana make a decision. Msee hadi akikwambia kitu, mm -hmm. it's upon you wewe mwenyewe. Uamwe mm -hmm. utafuata kitu amekuambia amo sifate mm -hmm. so i'm a boss of myself wow mm. yeah. so, when you boss boy mwenyewe account iko fiti siende huko account iko poa si ndio kabisa wow wewe ni boss mbona mbona okay kuna songo pia mm -hmm. as an option mbona uko fikiria for songo sasa so, unajua msanii anaenda kuele kitu yenye iko in a nice so <laughs> usinge jita songo boy i flow <laughs> boss boy na flow rice <laughs> Mzee kama wewe ni boy uko pale nje mzee na uko katika hali na struggle to find a name. Boss boy ame drop one of the one of the names hapa. Haina mtu Songo boy. Na hiyo ni so I'm going to take that. Mzee pia ni a promising name pia. Yeah. Ni a promising name. Yeah. That end of the day you're going to be a boss. You're going to be a boss. Unaita blessing mzee kwa watu utakao in charge kwa pia. Yeah. Wow, that's a good introduction of IV from Bossy Boy and uh, MC Badges. But before Bossy Boy are diving into the, the to the set, tulikuwa na Badges hapo hivi. Uko unaeleza journey yako bana. Kwa hiyo journey ambayo maybe you are saved and then uh, ume grow kwa family ambayo kidogo, it's a Christian family mm -hmm. and then diving to music to music and then fame ikakuja ikakwambia niaje bila jasho mimi niko how is that journey now? How did you realize that I'm doing the wrong thing now let me go back to the the right way? Um, ilifika time bro uh, tulikuwa tuna abuse drugs mm -hmm. and tulikuwa na mbogi i was with a group of friends mm -hmm. uh, we were using drugs lakini hizi zilikuwa anga chini ya maji mm -hmm. not a lot of people didn't know mm -hmm. watu walikuwa niona actually nilikuwa praise and worship to Jesus. make it <laughs> lakini nakapiga <laughs> Eh hey, nilikuwa nakapiga sometimes nakuja peni sasa hata nimedozia huko mabitu zangu nimekuja bado niko na hangover niko kwa piano church unapata na play piano tuna sing lakini deep down niko na feel ile guilt kwamba actually kuna something i'm doing that is wrong i love pia nakuta with time ile 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 peer pressure of course hiyo hiyo company i cannot call it bad company because because i also chose unaona i decided to be amongst them but as i, I think when things went by 
uh, kuna two time ilifika nikaona this thing is aitaweza mm -hmm. because kwanza i'm calling myself i am a gospel artist mm -hmm. i'm a gospel musician mm -hmm. why should i uh, uh, preach this and then i am living a, a life that is very opposite unaona mm -hmm. na, na tunasema pia msanii kio cha jamii mm -hmm. what if ule mtoto mdogo mwenye anani observe anasema i want to be one day kama huyu mc badges mm -hmm. but sasa akianza ku observe one this is my track ama this is how this guy lives it uh, itakuwa picha gani mm -hmm. Yeah, so that is how I ended up to actually transform completely. But it was not easy. Mm -hmm. Nikitu ambayo pia I was not ready for it because mm -hmm. pia nilikuwa na ile uh, watu watanichukua aje. Mm -hmm. Unawana watu wamekua wana juo mse, tumekua tuna stone with him. Mm -hmm. We have been drinking with him, partying with him. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden, I asked akuya tiyako serious and tumbia stories are gone. Unawana hizo 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 form. Mm -hmm. Ani kaza kusema, this one itakuwa tricky, but I think over, over time pia nikapata ile courage. Mm -hmm. And then I just came out boldly and make a this and can make your stand kwamba now mm -hmm. this is who I am from today mm -hmm. and this is how I want my life to be. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm just interested for, uh, for with your story. Mm -hmm. How did you balance now umetoka kukapiga and then the same time kwa piano church bila mse ku realize? Ah, uh, <laughs> ni hard. Ju kuna ile time sisi ni binadamu acha tonge mm -hmm. tonge tu reality mm -hmm. because reality lives. Yeah. Eh hey, hakuna PR hapa. Yeah. The thing is utajisahau mm -hmm. yeah utajisahau but for you manze uko consistent manze unakapiga church until ukapata hiyo conviction manze how did you balance that situation uh, i think to maybe niko na kichwa nilikuwa na kichwa ngumu hiyo time ina inaweza <laughs> inaweza hold up uh, alafu unajua nilikuwa nikitoka ukule niko natafuta ma fresh manini so mm -hmm. unapata kwamba msize ni soma sana wow. alafu kama nimetoka kama ni party ama whatever na ensure at least nimekuwa na kama 2 hour rest mm -hmm. nime rest kiasi mm -hmm. so that by hiyo time i can actually get uh, ni kuwe na ile humble time ya ni si dose but kuna time nilikuwa na lemewa church mm -hmm. na inabidi na, na itisha usaidizi sasa mse aizi aizi jua the reason as to why i'm asking someone to come and help on the keys so i just go na na chill chill uko nje ni rest yeah au kuhata ki fasi ya kuongea siku moja bora na kuna mtu ndio kwa mwana okay fasi ni Kuna times nilikuwa napiga off bro. Kuna times nilikuwa napiga off. Sometimes unajua ume, umeenda watu watu wameshamaza lakini sasa wewe hata bado uko kwa dunia yako unaona. Sasa watu wanashindwa what is wrong with the pianist? Sasa ndio unashtuka unaona you come back to the normal. Wow. Yeah. Ni jani ya MC Baje za hapa hivi na nataka natuambia what is the next face ambao what is that office ambao ana hold size. But acha nikuja kwa boss boy bana. Mimi ni kutambua kama artist way back kitambo atakuwa tuna vibe tuko tunapinya nanga tu eh uko kwa sasa the jan okay actually uh, mimi nishaisema hapa nishaiko kwa isho i think this is my third time kukwa kwa uh, isho mm -hmm. yeah so jani yangu imekuwa fiti mm -hmm. but still fiti sana unajua of course si vijana kuna ile njia una una mess una mess hapa na pale yeah yeah but si haija kuwa mbaya sana mm -hmm. actually mi kitu nilikuwa nanisumbua ni nimelelewa baada kwa familia ya Kikristo mm -hmm. mzae pasi so nime grow na ile ile nini tu ya mm -hmm. kwa church sana but sasa inafika ng'a time where by na hii kitu happen kwa wasi wengi kwa watu wengi mm -hmm. yeah unapata like una, inafika time unaona ni kama hawa zao wanakuforce kwenda church juye ni pasi alishapiga unaona ni kama yeye alipiga sherehe zake kitambo <laughs> imefika time yako sasa na kukazia <laughs> yeah, so mimi ndio ni kama sasa ni nyivo sasa hapa jua ni kaziwa na mapero wake so yeah. mzee anataka kunipisha kizazi <laughs> yeah, but mzee mzee alifanya vitu mbaya mm -hmm. baadaye akakuja aka change mm -hmm. akakuwa mse akakuwa pasi mm -hmm. so mimi ndio na like ah, mzee alipiga sherehe zake akamaliza mm -hmm. Sasa mimi imefika time yangu nataka kunikazia ni kwa church sana. The more I'll insist mimi ni kwa church nikakuwa mimi nikakuwa away from the church. Mm -hmm. Nikakuwa na sumbo la street mazi shuleni mbo. Mm -hmm. But baadaye mimi mwenyewe nikakuja nikaka chini. Niliangalia tu mwenyewe God ananifanyia nini kwa life. Cuz after chuo mm -hmm. eh, kuna vitu mob mazi God alifanya. Mm -hmm. Like kuna vitu nilikuwa najua tu. Baadaye kitu kwa kwangu nikitaka kujua kitu the mona persist mzee god mwenyewe anafanya anga like na nikifanya kitu na ka like mse mwenye amezoea kuifanya mm -hmm. na ka kama like ama legend to it yani nime nimekuwa na mazoea mm -hmm. so niko na like kuna gift god amenipatia mm -hmm. na hakuna kitu mimi na return back to god umecheki mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so hiyo ndio ikafanya like nikasema eh kama god anisaidia sahi mm -hmm. sijaifunzwa graphics mm -hmm. 
napiga graphics mm-hmm. sijai like before nitamwaga kama na dance mhm oya bai kifika dance nilikuja na kwa one of the best dancers mhm mm-hmm. niko na like before tena before dance nilikuwa nacheza futa mm-hmm. nilikuwa the best footballer Oh. Nika kuja dance nika kujuka kuwa the best dance. dancer mm. nika kuja side graphics mm-hmm. i'm one of the best graphic designer so nikaangalia hizi vitu zote nikasema hizi vitu zote ni juu ya god mm-hmm. mimi mwenyewe nafanya nini god hiyo mm-hmm. ndio ikabidi mazee nimeingia mm-hmm. nimeanza kujipeleka church tu mwenyewe pole pole hadi nikazoea sasa hakuna mm-hmm. hakuna tu msali pambe hakuna msii na kwanza hiyo time msiko nataka mtu ni force <laughs> okay yeah hata buda kika mzee eh na imagine kwa pale kwa maybe you are watu wanasema simba ama ndo nini ndio word natumika huko ala gonda mlango mzee boss boy amuka ni time ya charge uko zile za eh mzee acha nikae gear 7 sorry sasa nimekazia actually ni kitambo sana ni kitambo sana yani ambie ati amko ende charge uh-huh. yeah hiyo ni mimi mwenyewe na kuanga tu self driven na jua tu imefika sunday wacha nifanye nini mara most sunday wewe zinipata ni kwa on kwa simu sijui kama usha try wow from saa mbili mpaka saa saba wewe zinipata on kwa simu mm-hmm. yeah hiyo ni time umetenga tu mwanzi god mwanzi wacha ni pay back kabisa kabisa ndio mm-hmm. hivyo okay boss bila wacha ni baki kwako what is that thing ambayo mwanzi yu unajivunia kwa mtu yu pasi and what is the next thing unajua kijivunia pia kuna pia upate kulalamika kidogo ama i feel like mwanzi atai part singe part singe za ku kuweza ku kukuja forward na that energy 100% ku put out ku kwa mtu yao pasi okay mm-hmm. feeling about kwa mtu yao pasi ni mm-hmm. the good feeling ni unakana mse ambaye ni role model wako mm-hmm. uni mse unaangalia life yake inendaje mm-hmm. uni mse unaona like akikuwa kwa ngori ana solvage ya ngori mm-hmm. so wewe mwenyewe una follow your steps like mzee wangu ni mse mwingine anaanga wasiwasi hata ngori iko mbaya aje ametulia eh hey, yeah, ame relax tu ana wewe oh, god atafanya kitu mm-hmm. so amenifanya hadi mimi mwenyewe niko kaa yeye sasa like uko kwa ngori noma lakini unajua ah hapa mbele kuna kitu god atafanya mm-hmm. hii situation ni hard cycles mm-hmm. kuna mteremko pale mbele mm-hmm. yeah Okay, I understand that umekuwa kwa dance uh, you are the best dancer and so many guys umekuwa na ku lift. I've been vibing with people that uh, at the end of the day at the top of the mountain is not easy. You are lonely, you are uko peke yako. So mm. many people are looking up to you. Hakuna yeah. msana offer ile support kwako. You are the only one who understand that vision. Yeah. Kwa that kada dance group hapo hivyo. Now the time ambao umeambiwa say eh hey, najua ulikuwa unapiga sherehe lakini sasa right now <laughs> Mimi ni mamu wa manzeni ni go back to Christ and mm-hmm. aso alitekaje na how was the the reaction <coughs> Actually ili kuja ili kwa ili change ili change ili kwa like ni kama rutu na God alikuwa me decide tulikuwa bonding ine strong sana na hawa enza mm-hmm. kwa kudance mm-hmm. but ikafika time where by nilingia hustle mm-hmm. so ukapata like hustle ikakuja more of dance mm-hmm. ikafika like kwa zoezi na hata zoezi ya, ya dance mm-hmm. for some time so wasali kwa mzee wa kunimiss mm-hmm. na juu nilikuwa fit nilikuwa nikipiga hata zoezi for two days mm-hmm. niko sawa kupanda stage mm-hmm. nikimiss hizo two days wasali wanapiga show mm-hmm. bila mimi niko na ah wasali wanaweza piga show bila mimi mm-hmm. so ikakuwa rahisi mm-hmm. pia kuwa kuwatoka tu hivyo pole pole wow yeah. oh, tukuje kwa MC Badges yes bro kwa nakapiga Mm-hmm. Church pia na ujaiacha nyuma umekuwa yes. na tuna hizi vitu mbili <laughs> nayo nayo. Mm. Kuna hii challenge na sumbo ma boys pale out. Na najua yes, hata kuna mavijana maybe wako church down mm. manzi wanasema manzi sisi tuko for Christ. But the end of the day wanajipata to that section manzi and they cannot control themselves yeah. into that karum. Hii challenge ni wa super manzi. Yeah. Wewe kwa hii hasoli yako mm. wa super walikuwa umeweka wapi? Wasupa walikuwa bro. Yes. Uh, kuna jatu danganyane. Mm-hmm. Uh, wasupa walikuwa I was in into sexual immorality mm-hmm. for sure. Mm-hmm. Um, many times I remember sleeping with girls anyhow like I said unajua when everyone sasa everyone knows you mm-hmm. everyone anajua oh ndo ule MC baje so tunamsikia ama ndo ule MC baje so tuna what tunamuona mm-hmm. oh kumbe this is the guy mm-hmm. asa unataka every event ukitoka lazima at least utoke na wawili watatu ama namba you know mm-hmm. then nilikuwa hivyo into sexual immorality mm-hmm. for sure but mm-hmm. pia il, yani ilifika time una feel kwamba as, as much as you are doing everything easy vitu zote mm-hmm. you still lack something kuna kitu bado una miss mm-hmm. in your heart mm-hmm. until when i came sasa kupata now kumbe it is the love of god mm-hmm. that it, it is the only thing i've been missing mm-hmm. all this time because in the in the ladies bado tuni i was yani just going to have 
I just enjoy sex and those stuff. Mm -hmm. But still, I am not getting what I really want. I couldn't have full satisfaction. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so to the young young people, pale in Jambao, they they really want to serve God. Like in uh, sexual immorality, may hold. Mm -hmm. it, it is something you need to decide mm -hmm. to come out from it mm -hmm. because you know, it, it starts with you actually mm -hmm. making up your mind mm -hmm. Kumba, you know what this is th this thing i don't want to live uh, my life like this I'm, this thing i want to live this character this way mm -hmm. so you could decide because no one is going to decide mm -hmm. actually on your behalf you you, you wake up with mm -hmm. every day Kumba, Mungu, give me the grace Kumba, i will be able to overcome these uh, sexual perversions mm -hmm. and the attraction and the last of the flesh because honestly <laughs> we are young people we are not yet married and yeah, this yeah. thing ziko 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 bro wow. at least it's crazy crazy to me like yeah. kuna, <laughs> in reality ziko that is very true hata kuna wanyoja waita lakini wana bado wana flow exactly wow. wanakuja wenyewe mm -hmm. too so okay you talk today we are talking about impressing change yeah. na is one of the topic ambayo mazemi i'm looking forward for it and uh, most of the guys like kenyans manzi tume impress change mm. kuna ile preso ambayo ilikuwa Mm. Sasa tuna muita former president. Mm. Yeah. Tuko na ile uh, naibu wake ambaye alikuwa pale hiyo sasa tuna muita president. Mm. Is the change? How did you get yourself now because all doing all this stuff as a, a young kijana mm. pale kwa church ni na nini? The process of now realizing yourself now moving forward is mm. not easy. Na yeah. tunajua ile kitu ina happen na change. Yeah. Automatically change iki come hivi. Boss boy atakwambia eh acha nipimie. <laughs> you na believe traditional yangu sana nimekana eh for long yeah. but this is something new wase wa kuangile za eh hey, wacha tuende nayo mm. but for you maze imekuwa imekuwa now a different one yeah. uka impress mpaka ukafika hapa hivi you can be able to testify yeah. how was that ka process yeah mm -hmm. so that process ilianza in 2019 mm -hmm. 2019 around uh, march uh, kuna something that happened uh, maybe some other day to keep at a time we will talk about it <laughs> nikakuja nikashikwa nikaenda nilikuwa hapa bungoma prison <laughs> Uh, nilikaa pale for three months in the remand. Mm -hmm. Sasa the period ambayo nilikuwa in the remand hapo ndo actually my Nini journey. Nini nilikuwa kushikwa? Uh, <laughs> Jua shika ngitu wasee like okay wata nenda kusanya wasee kwa rodi yeah, <laughs> yeah, wata wata pata mbele hata tubebe <laughs> Okay what happened kulikuwa na kulikuwa na case ambayo ilitokea ili mm -hmm. uh, kuna things ambayo zil, za mtu zilikuwa zimepotea yeah. na kul, ku, in that plot ambayo nilikuwa naishi to, we were staying with some other guys mm -hmm. so ikawa kwamba they had to take all of us pale mm -hmm. they had to to fanya ile inaitwa in investigations mm -hmm. to to come to understand what really happened ama what transpired do these things zikapotea because we were the closest people around mm -hmm. and the person ambaye vitu zake zilikuwa zimepotea by that time mimi ndo nilikuwa pale nilikuwa nimachiwa like the home mm -hmm. uh, not really a caretaker like in just to take care take to care. take care of the home mm -hmm. so that is what happened now during the period ambao nilikuwa remand mm -hmm. that is when my journey of realization ika, ika kwa serious actually with god mm -hmm. because hiyo time nilikuwa na i really thought about my life nikasema as much as i'm in here actually this is an opportunity for me to to realize kwamba the life nimekuwa naishi is not a godly life mm -hmm. and even the things i've been doing are not godly mm -hmm. na pia time nimekuwa hapo i was like yeah nimekuwa na a lot of friends mm -hmm. everyone anajua mc badges everyone nako happy about mc badges mm -hmm. lakini no one is coming even to see me in the remand mm -hmm. you know it's only my family ambayo i see my mom my dad my mm -hmm. sisters only sio ni hata wale mabest ambao i claim that these are my friends. Yes, so the time ambao nilikuwa hiyo hiyo uh, the, the investigation zikaisha nikatoka in in July. Mm -hmm. I, I went to to a friend in Nairobi, mm -hmm. nikakuwa pale church then in 2020 I went to to Mombasa. Mm -hmm. Sasa when I went to Mombasa of course na everyone knows akwenda Mombasa ni wanasema eh ni sherehe ule atazidi sherehe. Lakini ukirudi pia tuna expectation. Yeah, a lot of people know kwamba yeah when, when you go of course this one now is R lost mm -hmm. but the thing is like when i went sasa pale ndo nikakuwa serious kwamba now this is a, a, a new ground for me mm -hmm. now if i'm not serious with god up i cost ndapotea because cost now everything is happening there mm -hmm. so nika hold very serious mm -hmm. and, uh, until now so wow. that is actually just uh, how it started ili start in the remand wakati nilikuwa kule ndani mm -hmm. manza i remember nilikuwa na fast wish i fast ukiwa remand <laughs> <laughs> nilikuwa na fast brain no mm -hmm. yani yule time una plead uh, god for mercy mm -hmm. unaona because you, 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 are, you are trying to think kwamba hii case it is big you, you look at your family background you come from a poor i come from a poor background mm -hmm. so i'm like wa sasa tutafanya aje mm -hmm. because this thing i don't know even how it is going to 
to end up to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so so Palendani I remember manze. I love to na tena ile life ya Palendani. How was the environment then? Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. The environment was so harsh, bro. Mm -hmm. uh, breakfast to got na kula samoja, bro. <laughs> samoja na na jani uji viki kikap kidogo. Mm -hmm. Lunch ni sanne. Kwa na kula lunch sanne. Mm -hmm. Alafu sapa mna kula sa saba. Mkisha kula sa saba mna ngoja kesho. Unajua, <laughs> unajua mazeo ni ugali hivi na ka, 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 kasupu hivi. Amo ule jamaa mwenye na saba kisabi hivi yu, yu kabe jikipita hata kama ni pisi moja. Na hivyo una, hakuna kusimama, unasomo kisimama kwanza kurumisha. Unapigi wata bara, amo unanyanganyo yu food, unapata. Na kule ndani of course kuna ile brutality, watu wana kupiga, you understand. Kuna ile tu kuchoko zana, unapata pene, kuna watu kwa mepigia, nata wana uwana. You understand. Zasa ile life ya pale ndani, ili ni push kwa kona, ikabidi, ni decide kwa mba hapa, it is either God ama ni kufe tu. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So so I took it very positive kwamba <laughs> this thing actually li kwa God's plan kwamba in push kwa wall so that I come to rediscover myself bro. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Ukiona watu huko nje bana heshima kila mtu uh, so that uh, the end of the you watu wanapitia nini na ujua wamepitia nini kufika level wenye wamefika so the end of the day haikupati uh, room for you kudharau mtu ama kuona afai but the end of the day wampatie to that love ya Christ na kila kitu kwa salama sana so that the end of the day ukisikiza story zao you can be able to just go back na kuambia god mzee hata mimi sijapitia si ndio this is the blessed one happening right now of course the conversation is about change and iko na watu wawili sana tulikuwa na mzee MC Budges put your hands together for akini is easy and then kuna pia bossy boy one of the greatest dancer hapo hivi graphic designer na kila kitu but uh, that one leads me to bossy boy mimi hmm. kujua kama dancer now you're talking about graphics design nikikutana na wewe juzi you are like manze nataka nataka canon uh, canon whatever <laughs> then i was like okay so i'm sorry kuja hii level ni sawa what happened between dancing from dancing coming to the office of graphic design and then now to the camera side okay uh, graphics uh, mostly una wewe na deal na pictures za wase mm -hmm. yeah so mimi nikaangalia like kwa picha msana kutumia picha umundie kitu kama post wana na hii picha na miss vitu fulani na fani ungeze kitu fulani so hili nifanya like ni kataka kujua kuedit picha so hii kani drive into photography na vile nimekuambia tu vizuri ni kitaka kujua kitu god ufanya tu like niki kwa tu serious na ya tu niki persist haichukua ngi time without me kujua hiyo kitu so ika kwa tu hivyo tu na right now on deep into photography tena na videography yeah What is that thing about una, uh, okifanya kazi yako manze you feel like manze I'm blessed. Mm -hmm. Juu kuna watu wanafanya juni job. <coughs> yeah, I can report 8 juu nafanya report 8. Hizo mm -hmm. ni rules zimewekwa yeah, nafanya report 8 nafanya report 8. But the end of the day hawana ile satisfaction. Mm -hmm. But you you feel like manze niko na satisfaction manze na even without somebody kuniambia ni ndio kitu fulani mm -hmm. I can be able to be at the, to that office at a certain time ambapo naweza kufanya shughuli zangu. Nini yeye nakukipia wewe ku move to that direction? Okay actually ni vitu nataka ahead mm -hmm. yeah target vitu nime target kwa life yangu mm -hmm. ndio zinafanya hii kitu si passion apart from passion mm -hmm. pia unajua kuna vile nataka kujijenga mm -hmm. actually nikijua hii kitu itanijenga in future mm hiyo -hmm. itani push work more harder mm -hmm. yeah work more harder mm -hmm. and smarter mm -hmm. yeah. ajua angalia ma graphic designer wengine bwana anini na kubo <laughs> What is that thing that you look at a certain post and then you're like manzi wow mm. i wish ningepata mm. opportunity to work on this work in this project Okay actually me kitu vile nimesema tu photography kitu na ni bodu sana 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 kwa graphic design ni poor quality ya picture kwa poster alafu pia poor arrangement kwa poster unapata like mse amekupatia poster ujue utaanza kusoma kutokea wapi mpaka wapi mm -hmm. eh unapata huko jua ameka tarehe katikati ameka siju watu watu representing nini of which any arrangement iko mbovu tu hiyo mm -hmm. ndio waspendi kwa poster yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow ako katika art industry na art industry ni kubwa because the end of the day uh, kuna DJs kuna wale wa event organizers kuna prod, uh, producers kuna wale sana piga uh, audiovisual services and then sasa unapata wase kuna ma graphic designer pale out so we're gonna dive into that conversation but today we are discussing about impressing change unajua kama kawaida walikuwa wamejiandaa kwa kum, mada ya leo na sasa ni time ya sisi kuingia deeply into the topic of the day impressing change maybe mc budgets nini yes, you understand by impressing change um, 
what I understand by embracing change ni, ni yani allowing uh, yourself to uh, to be transformed ama kukubali whatever changes ziko around you so the changes can either be inaweza kuwa positive or negative so embracing change in a, in a, in a mean you 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 actually you you accept you accept it how it comes maybe ulikuwa this way and now things is may change maybe umekuwa like mimi sasa hivi natembea na two legs eh? mm-hmm. and then all of a sudden ime, umepata accident mm-hmm. then you pain unfortunately ume break, ume break one leg mm-hmm. so you have to to embrace change kwamba now from today mm-hmm. mimi nimekuwa kilema unaona mm-hmm. so so that is what i understand kwamba uh, it is accepting now the reality kwamba things as it akuwa vile zilikuwa back how you ulikuwa mezi understand ama how you are used to mm-hmm. and it can either be positive ama negative. Acha nikuja kwa boss ibu. What is that change yenye ilikuja without you noticing? Like kulisi tukia tu mazeni iko. <laughs> Lazima wacha kaende kaende. <laughs> Actually ni vile nimesema hivyo eh mimi mwenyewe nilifikiria tu like let me go back to church. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hivyo tu once tu niliingia TV church nikaangalia life ya church mazee iko fit. Mm-hmm. God amenifanyia vitu mob. It's high time pia mimi nifanye nini? nifanye kitu mm-hmm. that's where change ilikuja na kuingia church tu hivyo immediately mm-hmm. nika mimi mwenyewe nikajicommit tu kwa god nikaamua tu that's all hakuna mm-hmm. vile nita go back tena wow. yeah and mm-hmm. each and everyone manzea kuna environment maybe uh, how wewe umefanya umeingia church because it it ilitoka ndani ya moyo wako wewe kuja church manzee kuna vile una inspire wase ama kuna vile okay it's a solo thing actually eh, mse nimesema like my name boss boy mm-hmm. kila mse anakuwa boss mwenye mm-hmm. yeah mse lazima uta inspire mm-hmm. but decision yeye mwenye kukubali kwenda church kukubali Christ mm-hmm. it's upon himself mm-hmm. yeah ni yeye mwenye unajua kianiza kubali na mdomo but deep kwa roho mm-hmm. yake hakuna kitu the heart is the center of decisions mm-hmm. umecheki so kama ja decide na roho yake mm-hmm ame decide tuna mdomo mm-hmm. there is nothing we have done there wow yeah mm-hmm. so ni mse tu mwenyewe mm-hmm. a decide mm-hmm. for me sat wow nafsi budgets najua kuna marafiki wengi tu sana mm-hmm. na we are talking about impressing change yeah. kuna wale kuna ile changes zime happen kwa life zetu mm-hmm. because of friends maybe mm-hmm. kwako what is that the thing it happen kwa life yako because my best in a positive way mm, in a positive way yeah i think uh, the first the first change ni actually just being able to to kuja issue mm-hmm. and just speaking to people ambao uh, they are viewing us right now mm-hmm. kwamba this is a big, the biggest change uh, in a positive way kwamba mm-hmm. i surrounded myself na, mm-hmm. na na people ambao they they really love god mm-hmm. people ambao wako very focused mm-hmm. yeah, and apia kanipatia a challenge kwamba I think I need also to be this way. I need to to be focused in life. Mm-hmm. I need to think quickly what do I want in life by the way. It's not just about fun and partying and mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. Kuna time inafika you start thinking, "Ai, wasi wako wana progress manzi." Ndakuwa wow. nazidi kila siku mimi kupati tu na kufanya nini. Mm-hmm. Na life I song. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and also just uh, being committed in church. Mm-hmm. Uh, and also say ukiangalia the, the music I, 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 I I'm releasing. Mm-hmm. Yaani iko na content very wow. very very at least yani na kashi a deep one. one I think deep na na try to bring message yani clearly to people mm-hmm. but back then ilikuwa nga tu tufanya muziki na ni producer beat lyrics and zinakuja <laughs> <laughs> but say unaona before 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 ni andike ngoma I'm trying to think actually mm-hmm. what message am I am I sending to people mm-hmm. but back then okay earlier vasoni naongelea hii vasti naenda kuongelea kitu kingine mm-hmm. yeah so those are the some of the changes zenye naweza sema zime happen mm-hmm. actually in my life wow yeah <laughs> Biti kuje twende vile tunaenda ni song ina kwa hit ama ina hit anga tu studio and then you are like okay imemalizika the song ya sai ama ya back then ah, ah ya back then ya back then ina hit because unajua pale unajua una, unakuta kwamba people actually i came to understand people are pending lyrics za song people wanapenda the, the beat <laughs> unapata sasa msaki para beat inaenda hivi ina, ina gonga but so watu wana dance to the beat they are not keen to listen actually to what is this guy even singing in this song mm-hmm. mm, but tunakuta 
wakati unaanza ku release ama ukianza sasa tuseme sign anza kuimba worship mm -hmm. eh maze hata hata views na jira kwa le <laughs> sasa anaanza kusema asa una ubajes maze anaanza anaanza kuimba ma worship ma slow song unaona mm -hmm. but ukianza kuangalia message ambayo kinakuja in that song mm -hmm. ukithink about it ndio utakuta it is very very critical and it is very key rather than twende to to do uh, uh, beats na people love watu wanapenda emotions that emotions, move yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, bro. Wow, bossy boy. Yes. The same question na ina kujia kwa kwa manze. Uh, na change me happen a lot. Apa na pale. Mm. Kuna so many people uh, me kujia in your life manze. Uh, and you like uko pale juu sa easy. What ona kuona? Uh, kuna question ni kwa meuliza MC badges manze. Yali handle aje manze. Awa tu wa marafiki zetu pia wa kike bana. Na hiyo wewe sa easy manze uko pale. <laughs> manze. Watu manze ma bossy boy sa easy na wakini you know, one of the biggest photography in town. Uh, so they can flow without knowing like okay um say a code how handle large that situation okay actually ukuja mademu ukuja eh hizo temptation kwa mob but the way ni mesema like in life um say once kuna kitu ume target kwa life yako utajua hizi vitu zingine zinyi zinakuja around hizi ni obstacles mm -hmm. zinakuzuia wewe from reaching where you want mm -hmm. so uki once ushe kana hiyo mentality ya ah Udem mwenye amekuja hii style mm -hmm. aja kuja na kujijenga hii style amekuja si ya kujijenga mm -hmm. actually there is no where we are going mm -hmm. utajua si ni binadamu tunatambua tunaelewa mm -hmm. ya yeah, utajua tu hapa hivi udem style amekuja mm -hmm. hii tatuklid wapi tatuklid pabaya mm -hmm. so ni we mwenye maze mi mwenye uka chini na njua tu ah uwe style amekuja hii ayezi msaidia mm -hmm nini nataka mm -hmm. yeah so my focus kwa kile nataka mm -hmm. ndio nisaidie na ku avoid hizi vitu zingine mm -hmm. yeah and the same question nakuja mzee how do you handle your low emotions because it's a change <laughs> <laughs> kuna vile naamka leo na film mzee wow eh hey, leo niko na 100% but kesho yake mzee unaamka na film mzee hata ufiki 90 mm -hmm. oh handle large both you <laughs> eh sele mara most unajamii wa sick hiyo hiyo kitu mara wasenge menzoea sana na kuongea muongea sana upiga story sana mimi yeah. sana yeah. so iki tu niki the way me handle my low type moments mm -hmm. mara most na avoid wa say wanapata tu nimekaa solo uh, nimetulia tu na cheza cheza pale na lapi mm -hmm. mchoch vitu ni hapo ndio by the my low moments ndio mu come na o come up na new designs vitu yani zile amazing za the god and speak yeah ile time yenyewe mama acha tu nika eh sahi cuz low moment ni jo kila msana kwa gana asira the bible says ujam ukasirike but ustende dhambi yeah so of course ni ngumu sana ukasirika na ukose kutenda dhambi mhm ni ngumu sana ukasirika na umekaa na waseni ukose kwa kuwakosea so mu prefer like your my low moments eri nikae tu solo niangalie ni nini naweza fanya tu hapa around mm -hmm. unajikuta mazee umekaa pale hivyo nimetulia ni mwana design imenibamba nini mm -hmm. yeah so yeah, at least na nudisha psych wow yeah wow so you avoid what say that ni, is mara most mimi uka tu solo hata nasema na tu ah naweza kolosa na mwambie leo mazee singitao na tulia tu hao yeah wow then, wow lazima simo <laughs> yes you could hivyo hivyo na your dad akikuwa na in that state anajua tu okay maybe una una heal up on something But then him say mwingine ame ame amenizoea sana like there was a time nilifanya hivyo mm -hmm. na ilikuwa for two days nilizima simu for two days so watu wakanitafuta madhi akanitafuta then job nao akasema ah boss boy hezi kosa kuja job boom say ni msiki mm -hmm. so one of my friends akapigia madhi at eh hey, bana boss boy ni msiki naonekani mm -hmm. so madhi ile wasiwasi mm -hmm. akanipigia aka simu siku siku zima the following day nilikuwa ni masha simu around majioni jioni tu hapo mm. madhi akapiga simu akaniambia eh hey, wewe wewe ni mgonjwa na uwezi sema hata uwezi kuja nyumbani mm -hmm. so hiyo time alikuwa ambia hadi mzae tutafute umse mm -hmm. ni mgonjwa unajua mara most nikikuwa mgonjwa mimi wasiseni mm -hmm. ka tu hivyo tu mm -hmm. spend dawa spend kutibiwa mm -hmm. sijui nikoje mm -hmm. but na mimi uka tu hivyo until na kuja napona mara most na ni rare niko msik mm -hmm. more than god jua hiyo mm -hmm. ni rare sana niko msik wow wow, wow. <laughs> yeah Adi ni kikwa msiki na kanga tu hivyo tu siendi osis mezi daa mm -hmm. na kuja tu napona tu mwenye wow. mm. So made au wapendi hiyo kitu made mm -hmm. wapendi Unaelewa tu mzazi yeah, yeah, yeah. Lazima lazima take, lazima kutake ya ba yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So made ya kadani umu sendi msiki mm -hmm. Amejificha ataki ataki wasewa juwe kama kawaida Akambia mm -hmm. mzae 
mzee akamwambia wewe unjui unjui mambo ya klevi au mm-hmm. anitanga klevi huyo mm-hmm. labda ameenda tu kutulia huyo ametulia tu <laughs> so the following day kuna madhara mmetafuta sana ikabidi nimeenda home mm-hmm. madhara akaniambia wewe umekuwa wapi bana hizi siku zote umetulia umetunyamazia watu wanasema wewe ni mgonjwa umekuwa mgonjwa nambia mimi sijakuwa mgonjwa mimi nilikuwa tu nimetulia at even mm-hmm. the babako amesema tu lazima tu simu tulie <laughs> wow Yeye dada anatende ku understand vifiti sana. Yeah, anani understand wow. vizuri sana. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wacha tuingie nao because we're talking about change na uh, pia tutaacha challenge ambayo inatukumba sisi kama mavijana. Na tuko kwa Christ na lazima mimi upenda kusema kitu moja reality lives PR maze hiyo na, na kudanganya kitu kesho mwanzo napata vitu zingine zime change. Budgets. Yes bro. How do vijana handle breakup? How do vijana handle breakup? Yes. Uh, so that is the biggest challenge inapeleka wase to uh, to those rooms of depression of depression yeah, very yeah, true yeah. very true your question bro ni poa uh, how how vijana say wana handle uh, breakup ni kwamba they go into another relationship mm-hmm. mm. so unakuta kwamba you have not healed mm-hmm. from the uh, the previous pain mm-hmm. and then so say it's like you want to revenge mm-hmm. yeah na ndio inapelekea maybe umepata partner alikuwa na kucheat So ume, una, you move to another one mm-hmm. then the uh, the other one umempata pia na kuchi mm-hmm. so whatever thing ulikuwa umepata una, una look for hujaipata mm-hmm. you, you, you still getting more heartbreaks more heartbreaks mm-hmm. so, so then unapata people going to uh, depression and stuff jivijana mm-hmm. mm-hmm. watu hizi maze and there's a gospel show maze. they yeah. are seeking for solution because the end of the day I've been vibing so many guys ni kwambie if you mm-hmm. cannot offer a solution then Uh, in whatever field you are doing maze <laughs> stop mm. it go back ask yourself maze una do nini mm. uh, what is the safer way now to handle it because uh, at the end of the day it will happen mm. whether mm. you like it or not it happen in life mm. sometimes kwa, kwa life it happen yeah. so what is the safer way mm. yule kijana ambaye anakutazama pale nyumba nyumbani mm. amekuwa na msikia story yako anaona eh maze mse naweza blend na yake vipoa tu sana naweza mm. mfollow naweza mm. fata vitu nyana vitu zinyana do because maze story yake ni deep Yeah. Now we are going to the pulpit sector. Yeah. How do vijana handle the breakup in a safer way? In a safer way. Yeah. What I can advise uh, the, the young people pale nje who are who are watching us mm. actually now ni kwamba the safer way to to handle breakup is uh, first you need to heal mm-hmm. before you you think of even moving into a new relationship. Mm-hmm. Heal first. Mm-hmm. I think mimi pia kuna many times I was very quick to yani Uh, we we are we are to break up mm-hmm. so i'm looking for someone else to 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 find a comfort mm-hmm. yeah i don't want to deal with the the, the real problem mm-hmm. so the thing is come deal with the real prob- the, the real problem mm-hmm. the real issue may happen mm-hmm. and then before you move into a new relationship mm-hmm. ensure kwamba ume heal from the the, the pain hata kama ni kujipatia a break of one year ujipatie hiyo break useme now from today mimi kama MC Baje sama kama boss boy ama kama DJ Viano I will not be into relationships for for this period of time uh, until I heal until I'm sure kwamba I am ready for a new relationship and also uh, the, the 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 other safest way to to heal from breakup uh, just ask yourself actually what are you looking in a, for in a relationship because the relationship is not just about fun mm-hmm. and just kukua uh, ku have sex you mm-hmm. know mm-hmm. and just kukua na company no it's about us to, if we if we are dating where is this relationship taking us mm-hmm. is it taking us to marriage am mm-hmm. uh, are we just uh, having uh, uh, have, having fun mm-hmm. yeah sasa ukisha understand you understand like how boss boy was saying mm-hmm. okay ona this partner ni just for having fun mm-hmm. na wewe you are, you are someone who is serious unataka this thing he end up into marriage mm-hmm. you cut off mapema mm-hmm. yeah i think utukifanya hivyo it will really help us ku, ku, ku heal from ama to 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 help us to sifike ile point ya ya heartbreaks mm-hmm. yeah wow what if it a comment kadha hapo hivi kuna kuna anaitwa na anaitwa Josh anasema mwanzee wa sema umeweza mbaya sana content iko lit <laughs> poa sana then kuna noa anasema yuko tuned in msi huwa na watch the show the praise mix uh, inawabariki kitu sana wakikuwa na babu James and then kuna kifungua kiasi Uh, naitwa nani? Alikuwa na babu James uh, na mama Alice and then kuna Mark wote anasema wabarikiwe tu sana and then kuna Justo uh, watching all the way from BG. Anasema shukrani kwa sana uh, got a busy boy and MC Badges. Wow, nadhani mgoteka. And then kuna George anasema watching all the way from uh, Lutoni.
anasema show iko vizuri sana keep your feedback coming then i'll be able to go through them as uh, we progress with this show mm. so bossy boy yes. kuna one of the challenge inatusumbua sana mm. kama boys anajua tuko tu bado kwa change mimi mm. naona inaitwa when mtu yao pasi umechonga mm. kanywele <laughs> but iki tu inatusumbua sana because the end of the day watu wako na script vile wase wanafaa kuwa pia mm. we kama bossy boy ume handle aje hiyo challenge juu ni afika place kitu kwanza msana una show up msana kwa ngalivi anasema eh hey, wewe ufai kukaidi sai wewe unafaa kukaidi but the end of the day you don't want living your life yeah yeah wewe handle aje kama boys actually umecheki mhm eh wase uongea mob wase ubonga mambo mob but hiki kitu tunafanya au msame niambia boss boy ebu end uunde nywele mhm ndio wingie cha tumecheki wewe ni mtu hiyo hapa si unda nywele ndio ukaeka mtu hiyo hapa si actually kitu ndakuwa ni muunda nywele kumfurahisha yeye mm-hmm. but si kwa hapa kufurahisha watu mm-hmm. mimi nafikiria life yangu na god relationship yangu na god ikoje umecheki mm-hmm. so kama niko na nywele yangu but still god mm-hmm. but ile glory vile inafa mm-hmm. na msavu vile inafa mm-hmm. sio ni shida pale hivyo mm-hmm. yeah Wow. Mm-hmm. So the, what what matters up is the relationship between you and between God. me and God. Wow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not see unajua say people mm-hmm. judge a lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mtu anaweza kuwa amenyoa amecha kwa baldi yake tu mzuri lakini mm-hmm. matendo yake si kama yule msee mwenye yako na dream. Ampiga suti. Yeah. Unajua kila msee yako na back life. Utapata hata msee mwenye ananiambia nyoe nywele. Mhm. Yeah, labda maybe alikuwa nayo pale before. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's a process. At 40 years siezi kuwa na kaa hivi. Mhm. Umecheki. Then mzee atupate mwa Kenya mapema sana. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> eh, at 40 years siezi kana kai hivi. Itafika time ya by nitakuwa na familia nitakuwa na nini siezi kai hivi. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Itafika to time at age wewe mwenyewe unajua. Mhm. Amefika sasa hivi na hii mwana nakukaa kama mse mm-hmm. mtu kijana kijana hivi. Mm-hmm. Ah hapa nishapita. Mm-hmm. Ama maybe unaweza kupata ile job inakufanya nini? Mm-hmm. Inaku I kwa lao kwa na nywele mm-hmm. then unaweza ichonga. Mm-hmm. But unatambua tu usanii vitu vingine za usanii ukikaa na nywele hivi usanii pia anafanya YouTube content fulani pale hivi. Mm-hmm. So lazima ukaeke ki usanii kiasi hivi. Wow. So mm-hmm. ina inategemea ina, ina kwa monthly kazi yako mbona unafanya. Yeah, monthly pia inafanya. Wow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So what was it when a script to fold to fold? Ah, it was when a script. Usiangalie nywele ya mseu, ukaangalia appearance ya mseu, ukamjudge. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow, wow, wow. Mm-hmm. Yes, budgets. Yes, bro. Wewe sijui kama maipa yuwa, mipa, maipa tuwa automatically turn off. No let me say maybe ya likuita na akakucheki vile uko and then ya like maze hey we script yako i thought is this way but now the way you look at this this line ah uh, maze mimi nakupatia turn off yeah. how did you handle that situation i think i think some in a kwani heartbreak mm-hmm. yeah because it is not what you 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 are expecting mm-hmm. and i think as you were saying many many times by the christians of today to call very judgmental mm-hmm. We are quick to to judge others mm-hmm. lakini tunajisahau mm-hmm. about sisi wenyewe actually kwamba pia everyone ako na their own flaws mm-hmm. it has happened to me many times mm-hmm. na remember kuna time nilikuwa nga nime nimeweka nywele nimepiga hivi hapa line mm-hmm. asa umealikwa mahali manzee at this is the, the uh, tulikuwa tunaleta msanii wa gospel nini yani uki, hata si hawako niona yani ndio nilituma tu picha <laughs> <laughs> picha pekee this is the, the, the gospel musician uh, come on this is the gospel musician achaka ukapata tu call manzi usi step yeah, up usi step up mm-hmm. uh, there, there is a time pia kuna kuna time the, kulikuwa na event ilikuwa album wana launch somewhere mm-hmm. sasa ukasema we need uh, at least some 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 different artists to come mm-hmm. na kulikuwa na mimi and some other guys ambao pengine we were being thought tutakuwa kama the guest. Mm-hmm. But sasa mtu aliangalia tu the song, the video, eh? Akasema kama this is the the, the gospel. No, sisi we want the 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 the, the, the yani worship, you know those kind of stuff. Mm. Now which I respect kwamba everyone are gonna how they 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 see themselves ama venye church setting iko, mm-hmm. but it is not good actually ku ku judge. Wow. And uh, talking about music bana kuna tumekuwa tunazoea kina muziki kina usinje kina Yunis Njeri mm. and uh, there is this man manze uh, manze uh, aleni bamba tu sana aitwa yeah. Timamu 
ukiangalia ushipiata na pigana shen kidogo hapo maze you feel like maze this is now the thing yeah. but uh, unajua kila mtu kwa na generation yake yeah, yeah you, you can command a certain generation but ukienda kwa generation like umetoka for a certain generation maybe mm. god alikupa purpose for a certain generation mm. the moment you drop for a certain generation that you kutambui automatic utakula turn off yeah, <laughs> yeah. isi makosa yako bana yeah. so uh, najua time inaenda tu sana bossy boy watu wanakupata wapi wewe ufanya nini uh, throughout the week na maybe if kama wasa anaweza connect na wewe bana unajua so many youth wana coach pale hivyo na kuna wale pia wame wanashuhudia eh bossy boy sikuiza me change wow yeah. <laughs> wao well, hata nikupatie time so that you can share your where people atakupata na what you do yeah. okay. mm-hmm. Mupenda sana kuita magwiji. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mungu itase wangu magwiji sana. Wakurugenzi. Yeah, magwiji. <laughs> <laughs> so magwiji pale home na njoo mko freshi. Mm-hmm. Eh, Tukuwa hapa kwa Praise Mix leo. Mm-hmm. Na mimi mtadifata all social media handles kama Boss Boy Creation. Mm-hmm. Like, Tumi ufanya mini graphic designer, mini photographer. Mm-hmm. Utanipata pale family fair. Mm-hmm tapiga picha zako moja safi tena classic mm. na apart from hiyo tena utanafanya content flani ya YouTube mm. inaitwa Gwiji vibes hapo na interview wa se wote wenye wako na ma talent vijana wote wenye wako na talent mzee mnafika pale tunapiga story na nako fresh ama vipi wow ndio hivyo mm. wow na before to watch the boss boy yeah. kuna brother yake and this one I'm serious yeah, about yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious about it what did you bash Yeah, I'm a social media, mm-hmm. MC Budges. Mm-hmm. Budges ni B U R G E S. YouTube, uh, Facebook. Uh, most of the time kama una you follow una follow my 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 Facebook posts mm-hmm. na, na share sana on Facebook social media mm-hmm. about the love of Christ and mm-hmm. stuff. So that is basically what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. Uh, Um, pia sasa hii niko pale hard town niko na hustle niko na uza nguo sasa kama unataka nguo nini kladi kladi hivi kladi kladi hivi wow. unaweza nitafuta unafika kwa manjumu dress baada sijafika hapa unaweza nitafuta pale ni ku dress <laughs> yeah so to support uh, i think it uh, we, we 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 have a uh, ile passion for young people and i think pia I, I'm, i'm so glad ya kwamba umetupatia an opportunity to share actually uh, what we have uh, i think mimi sometimes i look at my life uh, na naangalia how i have been and actually what god is doing na nafanya na kuwa very passionate for for youths kwamba there is a lot of youths out, out there ambao pia wako wanapitia such a life lakini because peine hawana anyone to talk to them i think in an impartial that a uh, opportunity kwamba uh, at, at least we can speak to them and it's good um to party wow, such an wow. amazing opportunity wow karibuni tena na tena uko ni home thank you na lazima wacha unajua kazi ya Christ Jesus lazima tuweke pamoja so that the end of the day lazima to speak to our generation bana because the end of the day kuna ma boys wako pale church vibe inatoka huko manzi maybe inatoka kwa the older generation unashinda eh manzi tutashikanisha vipi manzi so akipata yule boy manzi ana ako na the same vibe vile iko the word of god vile iko but ana put into set up that they can be able to understand to embrace it and above it all manzi kuli kuli vile life uko as in fully like unajibamba na ni Christ as in una anything that you want maze the only person am access ni Christ maze mm. that is a dog thing maze mm. because uh, watu wanasema to understand how say do you we will understand because generation to 40 can am saying to 40 so it 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 a grace ya god for you to understand them yeah. wow yeah. thank you so much for coming through bossy boy na mc badges na jota imeenda tu sana lakini kuna uh, peri sana sema ni wasalamia tu sana <laughs> she's, she's, she's watching the show asante sana so pale nyumbani change na happen in each and every sector hata wewe kufeel tu mzee uko down that's a change hata wewe kufeel mzee leo ma, hey, leo na feel niko na 100% energy that is the change so it depend how vile uta cope up with that change mm. na vile uteza itakupatia that room for you to transform yourself because the verse of today nasema do not conform conformed with the, the with the things of the world mm. na that is the thing ambayo you can be able to uh, go back to that verse na uweze kujua okay world in nini nini ni, ni god anazungumzia about the world si ndio mm. and each and every day we stand in for Christ Jesus he make the blessed one so as we dive into it ndakuwa na kuja na let us gospel it and then pia ndakuwa na msewa nguvu sana talking about movies <laughs> plays hata kwa na kama hapo hivi na ni boy wa church pia because today is a youth 
uh, Sunday so we can be able to represent in a dope way. Allow me to dive into the Mziti Kidogo. The song is by Manolo. Uh, uh, kin, uh, you can be able to dive into it. The uh, skis and I itakweza kubariki pale nyumbani. Itakwa vizuri sana. See you on the art world section. <laughs> 